رب اشرح لي صدري ويسر لي امري واحلل عقده من لساني يفقهوا قولي We welcome you all with Islamic greetings. Assalamu alaikum. I am Amalia Shafi along with some of my friends Sofia Tariq, Zahajan and Jodhri Prasad. Today we are here to talk about an important topic in maths which is which is LCM and NCM. So let's get started. Okay, so Sofia can you tell me what is LCM? Yes, of course Amalia. LCM is the greatest common factor of two or more than two numbers. We can find the LCM of a number by four methods. First is by listing factors. Second is by prime factorization. Third is by common division method, and fourth is by long division method. Yes, and it is also called the greatest common divisor. Okay, so how can I ask you a question about LCM? Yes. Which is the greatest number that divides one thousand thirty six, three hundred forty seven, and six hundred thirty three, leaving remainders one to three respectively? Okay, let me show you. So the question is, what is the greatest number that divides one thousand thirty six, three hundred forty seven, and six hundred thirty three, leaving remainders one, two, three respectively? Okay. The numbers are one thousand thirty six, three hundred forty seven, and six hundred thirty three. As I already told you that the remainders are one, two, and Three. So we will subtract these remainders from these three numbers. First, we will subtract one from one thousand thirty-six. That is equal to one thousand thirty-five. Then we will subtract two from three hundred and forty-seven. That is equal to three hundred and forty-five. Then we will subtract three from six hundred and thirty-three. That is equal to six hundred and thirty. Now the numbers we get here, we have to find their LCM. First, we will divide by five. So here. The quotient is two hundred seven. Then we will divide. That's equal to sixty nine. Here one hundred twenty six. Now we will divide by three. Sixty nine. So here the numbers we get. We have to multiply them. And the answer we get is fifteen. So it thus the required greatest number is fifteen. As we discussed about LCM, Imania, can you tell me what is LCM? Yes, Ipsan. The smallest common multiple of two or more numbers is called the LCM of the number. There are three methods by which we can find the LCM of the number. First, by listing multiples. Second, by prime factorization method, and third, by simple division method. Okay, Mania. Thank you for the information. Now, can I ask you a question? Sure, Dr. Sam. Okay. So, can you tell me which is the greatest number of six digit, which is exactly divisible by eight, sixteen, and twenty-four? Okay, I will show. So, the question is, which is the greatest number of six digits, which is exactly divisible by eight, sixteen, and twenty-four? So, let me show you. First of all, we have to find the LCM. Of eight, sixteen, and twenty-four. So two four are eight, two eight are sixteen, and two twelve are twenty-four. Two two are four, two four are eight, and two six are twelve. Two one are two, two two are four, and two three are six. Now one will come down. Two one are two, and three will also come down. Three one are three. One and one. So the LCM is equal to two into two into two into two into three. That's equal to two to our four, four to our eight, eight to our sixteen, and sixteen into three is equal to forty-eight. Now we have to divide. As we know, the greatest six-digit number is nine lakh ninety-nine thousand nine hundred ninety-nine. So we will divide nine lakh ninety-nine thousand nine hundred ninety-nine by forty-eight. 
48 into 2 is equal to 96. Now 9 will come down. 48 into 8 is equal to 384. 9 will again come down. 48 into 3 is equal to 144. 48 into 3 is equal to 144. So the remainder is 50. Therefore, required greatest number is equal to we have to subtract 15 from 9,99,999. That's equal to 9,99,984. Thank you so much dear viewers. I hope that you understood these topics. Allah Hafiz.